What's going on everybody in YouTube land? What's happening? This is Friday, uh, my 10.30 break on Friday. Another long day. Uh, my last cup of coffee for the day. It's nice out here in Georgia today. It's sunny outside, cool, not hot at all. We're just ready to get it over with. After I got off five today, I got to work 6.30 a.m. to 10.30. Um, oh, I'm getting my days confused. 6.30 a.m. to 5 p.m. tomorrow, Saturday, October the 3rd. So I'm just sitting out here. This is just a, I ought to call this my break time vlog. But it's my break go by, 15 minutes go by fast when I do this. Anyway, today, the other day, they usually give us the odds and then a little stuff. Today, they gave us uh, each a bag of this uh, Starbucks medium roast house house blend. Last time, they gave us a case of uh, the, the, the beans, and I grinded up in my grinder. Up in my grinder, I got one bag at home left now. And they gave us a bag of this. And they gave us... Container coffee mate, sixteen ounces. Anyway, that's what's happening. Of course, last weekend, last weekend I just got me a tall canister of Maxwell House coffee. I can't remember exactly what it is, but it's bigger than a regular container. It's tall. I got it at Walmart. So that right there lasts me a few weeks. I think when I use the rest of that, I might use the uh, this coffee here they gave us today because it's already ground up. And then I might go ahead and get get rid of that uh, other bag of Starbucks, the beans, grind them up and fix them, you know. But uh, I don't know why. Sometimes you go to a store like QT. I don't go all the time, but I just ran out. You know, one time I had enough coffee or something. And I stopped by QT on the way to work. And uh, it seemed like the caffeine is stronger in that coffee. I always figure it's because they grind the beans. Maybe it was a lot fresher and they grind the beans. But it seemed like you'd feel more caffeine in that coffee, you know. It smells good. I know when you go in there, it smells good. A lot of time I go in restaurants, and it's past my coffee drinking time. I don't drink it later on in the afternoon. I don't do all that. I do it mainly in the morning till noon. But when you go in a restaurant sometimes, I've even been in Hardee's before, and smell the coffee. It just smells so good. It makes me want to get a cup. Uh, but yeah, I drank my big cup in the morning before I come to work and I fill my, my Stanley thermos up. And then 8.30 break, I'll drink a cup. And then 10.30 break, that's it. That's it. Then I leave my thermos in my truck. I might have a drop left in the thermos, but that's about it. But, uh, yeah, I got a vlog yesterday. I got another vlog. I don't know if I, what I call it. A break time thing. Yeah, I got one yesterday I put on here, but I didn't upload it yet. I forgot all about it. I kind of forgot about it and got got doing other things. And uh, I'm going to put it up probably. I might put that one up tonight. It's nothing special. Just me talking right now, basically. But uh, yeah, a couple people asked me, you know, why well, won't you make a video? They like they, Some people laugh at my videos. Anyway, that's what's going on today. I forgot I had another biscuit in my lunch bag. I was going to eat that at the next break. Now, what it is, I had me a Jimmy Dean biscuit, right? The frozen biscuit that I eat. I eat that about every morning. I eat it for my breakfast, just put some on my stomach. And what it is, a co-worker of mine that works with me doing the inventory of what I do, doing what I do, he said, uh, I got your biscuit, you know, in the refrigerator, blah, blah, if you want it, you know. He, like, he likes uh, Chick-fil-A, you know, so... I said, oh, did you? You got me a biscuit. And, uh, I said, okay. And he told me where it was in the refrigerator. So he has sausage and Chick-fil-A. He said, I can get either one of them. So I got the Chick-fil-A one. And I ate that one. I ate the Chick-fil-A biscuit. And I still got my frozen biscuit. Well, it's not frozen no more. So my lunch bag. I might just eat that and save that for tomorrow, I guess. A lot of times I don't like thawing it out unless I eat it the same day. So that's what I ate at 8.30 break. I ate that uh, Chick-fil-A biscuit he brought me. And I was going to eat that other biscuit now just to, just to go ahead 
and get rid of it, but I might just save it. Uh, yeah, my birthday's Wednesday. I'll be another year older. The one I just talked about that uh, that brought me the biscuit. His birthday's on Tuesday. Mine's on Wednesday. I'll be turning 54, and he'll be turning 60. So anyway, you know, by the time I do, do, get done doing this, break's about over with. Ain't much happening. I can see people running or going to their cars here and there, going to break. Parking lot's pretty full. There's a couple spaces over there. That took forever to get out here yesterday. We had two track and trailers in front of us. And this road right here, it's just got a stop sign. And you got this warehouse cross street that just opened, uh, I think last year it opened. And I take a left, you know. But anyway, track shows were going, and uh, the co workers of mine that were leaving too, they was behind me lined up, and all of a sudden they'd start flying around to the left side and shooting out there. And, and I, was, I decided to do it too. I went ahead and did it. I just keep thinking to myself, I'm going to end up screwing up, and it's going to be my fault. But right here, we go on the left side of them. One time I got up there and I took a right. I took a right and I was going to do like a U-turn like a lot of people do and come back up. I did. I took a right and did a U-turn. Man, I sat there for a while before I even passed my job again. It's like my job's still up there. I hadn't even passed by it yet. It's just so crowded in this area here in Georgia. They're building, they're building too much at one time. Last time I went down through there near my job here is like it's like maybe eight warehouses, brand new warehouses they're building hadn't even been occupied yet. Shoot, let me, uh, let me close this video out and I'll, I'll, I'll upload mine as I, I'll upload the one I made yesterday when I get home and I'll upload this one. I just thought I'd drop by and say, hey to everybody while well, I'm on break. I got off 5 p.m. today and then tomorrow come, go in for 10 hours to, uh, 6 30 a.m to 5 p.m again and it kind of looks like right now the way it's looking because day shift was going to work 10 hours today yesterday and today and they was talking about them working mandatory tomorrow they got a message yesterday saying the hours